So guys, for the first step, you want to head over to search and then type in device manager. Click on it. Now once you're on this, you want to expand display adapters and then you want to right click on your graphics card and click on update driver and then click on search responsibility for drivers. Make sure that the best drivers for your device have been installed. Now for the second step, I'm going to leave three links down below for NVIDIA, AMD and Intel. You want to download the software that comes with your graphics card. So for me, I have an NVIDIA graphics card and I got GeForce Experience. Now once you're on your software, you want to click on your drivers tab and then click on check for updates. Make sure that your graphics card drivers are fully up to date. Now for the next step, you want to head over to search and then type in File Explorer. Click on it. Now once you're on this, you want to click on this PC. Then you want to find your C drive or where you have Windows installed on. You want to right click on it and then click on properties and then click on tools and then you want to click on check and click on scan drive. Now for the next step, you want to head over to search and then type in device manager. Click on it. Now once you're on this, you want to expand network adapters and then you want to find your network adapter. You want to right click on it and then click on update driver and then click on search what's messy for drivers. Make sure that the best drivers for your device have been installed. Now once you complete all these steps, you want to restart your computer and then the problem should be fixed.